Okay guys, so a couple of days ago I was I was scrolling through my Instagram and I saw one of the Instagram famous girls um wearing this really cute skirt and I was like oh my gosh I have to have it so when I clicked on the website to find this skirt it was $70 and I don't have that type of money but this is the skirt super cute right I was like oh my gosh look at that the side of it I just even if I had the money I honestly oh yeah pop-ups I honestly just don't even think I'd spend that much money. I think I can make it myself. I don't, I don't know if I can, but I'm certainly gonna try. And I want it black. So, I went to the little ghetto store down the street from my house and found this like imitation silk skirt, black. Um, yeah, so we're gonna, we're gonna see what we can do. All right, well, you're gonna want a skirt. It doesn't have to be silk, but mine was because that's what the picture showed. You're gonna need a crystal panel. I got mine from California, downtown LA. An iron and some scissors. The first thing I did was measure out where I wanted to cut the slits in my skirt. I am terrible with measuring, but we tried. And I suggest you get fabric pencil so you don't have to be ghetto like me and use glitter glue. It didn't matter because I was putting crystal panel over the glitter glue dots, but still. Once I measured everything to the best of my ability and used my glitter glue technique, I began to cut slits in the skirt where the dots were. Okay, so first I cut the slits and they were too short. So I cut them longer, but now there's just way too many and it doesn't give that big gap effect where your skin's actually showing. And that's kind of what I want. So what I am think I'm going to do, I'm going to start cutting the crystals and applying them to every other strip. They look right. What I think I'm going to do is essentially cut these bare strips off completely so that it will leave more gap for my actual skin to show. So hopefully that works out. Otherwise, I just screwed up a skirt. So we're gonna see what we can do here. Once I cut the crystal strips out, I laid them on the skirt and I began to safety pin them to the skirt. Okay, so I safety pinned the crystals where I need to put them on. And these pieces, I think I'm going to cut them completely off in between so that more skin shows because right now no skin shows. And that's just not what the skirt looks like and that's not what we're going for. Okay, so I just cut the gaps, so now I'm going to apply these on better, obviously, but it looks good so far. Hopefully we can just get these crystals on the right way. Oh, I'm so excited! Okay, let's get the crystals.
also when I was ironing on this piece, this piece actually got some heat. So now it's crinkled up. So you want to be careful not to let the heat touch the other diamonds because they're like, they're going to melt. So I'm not entirely sure if they'll straighten out and I don't want to risk having my skirt look messed up. So I'm actually just going to cut a whole nother piece because that happened. Lesson learned. So now I'm going to take these away from the rest of the skirt so they don't melt either.